these maniacs who are encouraging our enemies, weakening our troops' resolve, and confusing the American people. Well, uh, you shouldn't listen to these uh, protests because they're obviously helping Saddam Hussein. Uh, who would have guessed that you could build a massive international peace movement uh, on the protection of Saddam Hussein? The media is culpable for the misleading of the American public. They bought into the uh, Bush administration's rhetoric. They and, don't understand and, that there is moral violence and immoral violence. We use moral violence. God bless this president. He is truly a great man. Reducing troop morale, confusing the American people, and emboldening our enemies. They are absolutely committing sedition or treason as far as I'm concerned. There's a huge difference between uh, uh, personal opinion and an opinion which degrades and debases our military in a time of war. It's a disgrace. I don't believe that mainstream media acted responsibly in regards to Iraq. You know, I was belittled. I was called a traitor. I was called crazy. Paul Azan of CNN accused me of drinking Saddam Hussein's Kool-Aid for making accurate statements in response to aluminum tubes. People out there are accusing you of, of drinking uh, Saddam Hussein's Kool-Aid. If I have an ideologue, then I'm a Republican ideologue. I'm actually a fairly conservative person who voted for George W. Bush, uh, but I don't allow my ideology to get in the way of the facts and the reality of my duties and responsibilities as an American citizen.